music's like the most important thing because it's a dance and obviously listening to the music and being on beat is very important. My name is Sam, aka Sheku. I'm 27 years old from North Devon and I'm a b-boy. So I started breaking in 2009 when I first saw the Step Up 2 movie it was and then I started uh, learning or like popping and locking on my own. I wasn't obviously doing it right but <laughs> It was a start. But then later on in the year, I saw the UK B-Boy Championships on TV. And that's where I first fell in love with breaking, doing all that like, tricks and head spins and stuff. I was just so inspired by it, and I just wanted to learn that. And then I saw the, the winners at the end of it. I was like, I want to be a winner. And so I, I dedicated my whole life because of that TV series that just happened to be on. So when I'm training for like a big competition, maybe like say three or four weeks away, I will, I'll be doing training. I'll be training like six days a week, four hours each day, five hours sometimes, uh, which consists of doing a lot of endurance work. So I do a lot of running and strength training just to make sure I'm on top of my game, to be honest. When I'm practicing for this competition, I'm just drilling the same combos and ideas, but to different music, different tempos of beats, just so that I'm prepared for anything that comes my way. I'm also like battling my friend and my crewmates. So we just do like rounds, maybe more rounds than we need to, just to make sure like our stamina is on point and just execute everything to the best level I can. When I'm battling someone, so many emotions are going right through. I forget all the stuff I've got planned in my head. So that's why I, it just turns into freestyle in the end. It's very hard to remember what exactly is going on. But I try and block out everyone who's around me and it's just me and the other guy, really. But you've just got to basically um, get in a mindset like no one can beat you. You're untouchable. And then bring that to the stage and just believe it and make everyone else in the room believe it. Top rock is usually the first thing we do before getting to the floor. It's our stand-up part of the dance whilst using different top rock variations. It's basically like our introduction. Go down. Go down is the move a breaker uses to go down from their top rock down to the floor. Footwork. Footwork is using your hands to support your body whilst executing a variety of steps. A freeze is holding a solid shape or pose with their body in time with the music. Power moves are the most dynamic element of breaking. This consists a lot of technique and control of movements. I'm getting a bit more older now, I'm starting to feel it, especially after training uh, and especially after competition, but stretching I definitely um, need to do a bit more, to be honest. <laughs> I try and look after my body as much as possible. If I've got like, an injury or something, like, I'm, I do rest and stuff. Probably the only injury I had, I broke my toe when I was competing once. I broke it and then we, we won the, the battle, so we went on to the next round and obviously I made it worse because I had to keep going. To be a good breaker, you need to have coordination, strength, a creative mind, and just want to be one of the best. If you enjoyed this clip, feel free to follow the links on screen for more interesting articles and free courses from the Open University.